back with relationship advice and this one is a doozy. Okay, so I'm sorry it took me a while to get to this relationship. Let, let's go with the question, okay? So Tanya has written in about Joe. I already know Tanya and Joe. Don't let me introduce you to these people again. So Tanya has written it to me and said she has been with a boyfriend for five months. And everything is going great. He's perfect. He's the kindest person, sweetest person ever. But there's a small problem. They decided to start having... I know you guys don't like to talk about it, but here we go. Yes, the word is sex. And the problem is he doesn't have a... He just has a small package. And she doesn't know how to talk to him about his small package because he's already insecure about it and feels really horrible about his small package. Oopsie. So how do you talk to him? It's what Tanya wants to know. How, do, how she, can she talk to Joe? And I'm just going to let you know, and this is things I tell people all the time, don't have sex if you can't talk about it. <laughs> Like, really, you have to be able to be open-minded and talking. These are situations that really are, like, a difficult situation that can hinder a relationship. It doesn't all the way hinder a relationship, but it can hinder a relationship. So you need to be able to talk freely about things. And things like the size of a package is, to me... My opinion only, do not write down talking about that is not true. I've been with this and I'm telling you my opinion. I feel like you can work with anything. I don't care what size the package is, you can work with it. That's my opinion. It's just that some people don't take the time to learn to work it because of the simple fact that a woman's area is um, tender everywhere and it has ways that you can satisfy internally it's just that you are gonna have to probably do some exercise put her in a certain position not when it's uncomfortable but put her in a certain position to do it women you should know your body well enough to know what positions that really work so for any size to help in that place now i know there are people that might be so small that but i don't know any so i can't talk to you about that but i can be as real as i can be is there's a way to satisfy your woman and there's ways to satisfy your man. And if you don't take the time to learn and educate yourself, then it's really not going to help you in that area. I'm really going to have to do a uh, page where it's not on my Love and Live show where I can get really, really explicit because to me, this is like a family show. So I need to have a page. I'm going to have my, uh, my nephew, Sorak Eliab do that for me because I really want to get really specific on things like this to help because they're really, really important things and they're really, really details in there. But understand there's ways you can educate yourself. There's exercise you can do to get yourself limber. There's foods that get you in positions and not position, but that will help you give the energy so you can do these positions because sometimes you can't do missionary style. Sometimes you can't be vanilla when you don't have a big package or a medium package and you have a baby size package or a small package. Sometimes you got to be creative and it's all right and you don't have to feel so confident because I've heard and I've talked to lots of women that have dealt with small packages and has been very satisfied with the small packages. And I have some women, the same women have had big packages and the big packages don't know how to work it because they're not taking the time to learn the woman's body and the woman's body is very sensitive and can really make life a lot easier for you if you learn the sensitivity of that woman. I think I did really good without being very explicit because I could be explicit. Y'all don't know. I can be explicit. So this is really hard. Lola, don't even start talking because Lola already know. But I'm just wanting to tell Tanya that the best way to talk to him is say, you know what? I love you. And because we know that you have not the regular size. And we might have to do some different positions. And I've done some research on um, positions that we could do. This will be fun for us to play around and learn each other's body and, and enjoy each other. And so he feels not insecure. You didn't hurt his feelings, you know, his manhood feelings, you know. That's the best way to do it. Or if you too chicken to do it, because I know some women would be chicken. I used to be a chicken. 
you can just say, okay, we're going to do different positions. And then just get him into positions and tell him he needs to learn how to work it. But if the only reason I don't agree with being a chicken is because if you don't explain that he has to learn these things and man up, you know, manifest these things into existence, he doesn't know why he's doing this position and he might not be working the position the correct way that he needs to work the position. So that is my advice at this time. I will get more explicit advice when I get, he's going to work on something for me to be able to tell you guys if you really need to know more about this relationship with, especially this one, because this one to me is um, a really, um, I really like to talk about it because of the simple fact that I feel so sorry for men that have this situation and women that um, love a man but are not being satisfied sexually. I think this is a conversation that is well needed in this community, in this world. You know, I just really do. Because you don't know how many questions on the Talk It Out show that we get about men and women and sex. And um, it is something that I'm not going to do on this channel understand but um if you guys want to know anything else please email me on the love and live life four at gmail.com or comment below or instagram me and of course i will talk about your questions but tanya and joe you guys will make it make it to my next channel i'll tell you where you guys can start checking me out on other channels to get there okay i'll talk to you later and remember to what love and live each life has oh love and live each life Love and live each day as if it were your last. Love.